Hi Cozy Gamers! I played Paper Trail and I'm here to tell you my thoughts on the game, if I think you should play it, and my overall Cup Cozy rating. So get comfy and let's get started. Paper Trail is a top-down puzzle adventure about leaving home set in a foldable paper world. This is such a unique game and I can't say I've ever played or seen anything quite like it. I really enjoyed the story all the way through and all the characters you run into along the way really helped keep this story going. It took me nearly 8 hours to complete this game and I did it in one straight playthrough live on Twitch. I desperately wanted to see the ending of the story with my community, but I will say that it probably would have been better to break it up into a few sessions. The puzzles take a little bit of concentration to figure out and they do continue to get harder as you progress, which is great. It's not too easy, so this is definitely for those who want a bit of a challenge and to use that noggin of yours. I can't say enough about this art style. Absolutely beautiful and the way the pages folded over was so incredibly fluid this is absolutely one of my favorite puzzle games i've ever played even though i had to get help a few times and that's another thing you're never really stuck because there is an option to help guide you if you want it which is such a relief when playing a game like this sometimes our brains just cannot and instead of feeling stuck and frustrated we can get a hint so we can move along to the next one the puzzles never really got too repetitive because there are always different fold sequences on each puzzle. Some incorporate things like doors, ladders, moving blocks, rotating platforms, etc. Okay. Oh shoot. <gasps> oh! This is cool! Like the climbing of ladders! Oh, this is so cool! to grab oh it spins <gasps> wait so can it spin while i'm on it <gasps> it does Whee! look at me go i like it okay that's pretty cool actually and even moving certain objects to certain places to trigger something you need so there was always something new to think about I think if you enjoy puzzles and problem solving, then this could definitely be a cozy game for you and your brain. That's all there is to this game, but the overall aesthetic and environment and music was extremely cozy. Because of the complexity of some of the puzzles, I would say it's a cup cozy rating of 3 because there are no time pressures, you can take as much time as you need, get as much help as you need, but it's still a challenge. If you enjoy puzzle games and cozy vibes, then this is definitely for you to play. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel for more cozy content. I play cozy games live on Twitch and here on YouTube, and then I do reviews of all of them here on YouTube as well. So, turn on your notifications, and don't miss out on the next cozy review. Thanks for watching. Bye!